After a high-carbohydrate lunch, like a plate of spaghetti, polysaccharides are digested into monosaccharides. Monosaccharides, such as glucose, are absorbed by the small intestine and released into the blood. Increased levels of blood glucose signal the pancreas to secrete insulin into the bloodstream. Insulin promotes the uptake of glucose by most cells of the body. Many cells, like muscle, burn glucose for their metabolic fuel. Fat cells in adipose tissue use glucose to make fat. Liver cells convert glucose to glycogen and fat. As the afternoon passes, the cells continue to take up glucose, and blood glucose levels decrease. By 6 o'clock, all the glucose from the spaghetti lunch has been absorbed, and blood glucose levels have fallen further. The low blood glucose puts a break on insulin release from the pancreas. Without a glucose supply, cells switch to using glycogen and fat as their fuels. The liver breaks down glycogen to glucose and converts fat to fatty acids. Fat cells convert fat to fatty acids. These fatty acids are used by other body cells as fuel in place of glucose. The glucose released from the liver is reserved for nerve cells, which require a constant supply.